Hey, what's up guys? Looks like I got a package from Official Picks. Now, for those of you who haven't used them before, um, they're like a very reputable um, business. They do uh, private signings. They also do consignments for a lot of guests. They run the Star Wars Celebration signings and all that kind of good stuff. And they recently had signings with Mark Hamill, AKA Luke Skywalker. And unfortunately, when I found out about it, um, I kind of hesitated because I wasn't sure I wanted to invest that much money because this, you know, signature is pretty expensive. And I decided that, you know, I was thinking about it because I wanted to get character name and possibly a quote and all that stuff. Well, they sold out super fast on the character names and quotes. And so I was unable to send in an item, but I didn't want to be left out. It is a once in a who knows how long kind of opportunity. So I did pre-purchase some Funko Pops to get signed. So it actually worked out because I don't really have any uh, Star Wars Funko Pops, you know, for sending. So I just went ahead and pre-purchased. So everybody's been getting their items back and they've been posting online. I was like, all right, I got to check mine out. So here goes. Now, this is very well packaged. I mean, there's um, tissue paper, and then there, you know, the box is a good, good quality box. You know, it's from the post office. It's decent. Um, tissue paper inside to protect these boxes, and then within these boxes, there's more tissue paper, and the pops are sent in a, a, a pop protector. Now, do I have any complaints? Yeah, if I had to make a little bit of one. It's that when you're talking about a high-end pop like this with the autograph, perhaps they should come in like Funko Armors or a hard um, protective case. Now, again, it was so well packaged that you don't need it. Um, but I just think, you know, if you're going to sell something that expensive, put it in a better protector. These are kind of interesting protectors. Um, I'm guessing there's some type of coating on this because it doesn't look as clear as you would like it. But anyway... I'm going to go ahead and take this guy out of here so you can see it a little better because, like I said, it's kind of a grayish kind of feel to the box. Um, let me see if there's... Oh, yeah, there's a coating on it. You can see right there. Oh, right there is the peel. So, anyway, uh, I guess I'll, nah, I'll do that later. All right, so first one up is Star Wars Luke Skywalker, The Glows in the Dark. Jedi Entertainment Earth exclusive. That is pretty awesome. Um, now for me, placement of the autograph. Again, this is me being nitpicky, okay? This is not like I'm like, oh my God. I'm not upset at all. Um, for me, um, I think placement would have been slightly lower. So it would have been underneath his face. Would have probably been better. Um, you know, rather than across his face, but honestly, not an issue. I would have even liked it up here, like just above his face. Um, but still it's pretty awesome. Looks like it's a lime green paint pen. So very nice. All right. And then the second one, I'm going to go ahead and again, take it out of this little case. Now, while I was talking about the cases, oh, no. oh, there we go. These are actually really nice cases. I don't know what kind they are, where they get them, but they are a hard case, even though they're a soft case, if that makes any sense. Like this is super thick, super thick, uh, not like your standard. So I don't know what kind these are, um, but I'd like to find out because that's a good one. Now I'm assuming once I take off the film, it'll be even better. All right, this next one, Luke Skywalker, number 482. Ooh, I like this one because it's with Grogu. And I'm going to have my opinion on the signature, which you can probably already, already guess. Okay, same thing on this one. Um, you went right across the face. Like, why not go down here? 
you would have had a nice signature and it would have not have covered anything. But, you know, maybe he thought that would actually look better because it's in the middle rather than on the bottom. Eh, who knows? To some collectors, that would be exactly how they would want it. To me, I think I probably would have gone under. But who knows? I'm not the one signing it, so it doesn't matter. Um, anyway, two very nice pops. Mark Hamill, Luke Skywalker. Doesn't get much better than that. So I'm going to go ahead and put these in some uh, armor protectors and put them in the display.